Welcome to another edition to the Assassin's Sports Show, guys. Thank you for love, appreciation you bring each and every day. Y'all have the face to run the place. I cannot do the show. Watch out, guys. Thank you for likes. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for your comments. And, guys, thank you so much for taking time to watch my videos each and every day. Y'all makes fans. I cannot do the show. Watch out, guys. Plus, guys, if you by the YouTube channel, like the content, like the show, hit that subscribe button. Come Assassin today, guarantee. To my original assassins, thank you so much for supporting the show. My new assassins, welcome to the show. And those who have not subscribed yet, hopefully y'all can subscribe to my channel and make this the biggest, better YouTube channel ever before, man. So thank y'all. Y'all amazing. I cannot do the show without y'all, so help y'all know. One thing, guys, if you live, and I've been saying this, we got sponsors. If y'all been to this gym, Champ Zone Fitness, if you live in the Davy University area, Corn Springs, Plantation area, Go check them out. It's an awesome gym. If you want, I've been losing weight, gaining muscle mass. Just one of those things. You want to go try it. You want those six abs. Ladies, you want to feel good. Gentlemen, you want to look good. It's almost um, beach season down here. So go check them out. Like I say, University and Davey. All that, I'm telling you, if you say the promotion code, Assassin's the Sports Show on YouTube, they cook you up, guarantee you, and you're going to enjoy it. I got a lot of people, a lot of feedback, a lot of fans who have... Uh, come out and saw me, um, see me, sorry, see me out there and, and they're enjoying it. So, again, I am so happy that my fans have been enjoying that gym. I mean, I've been getting hit up about, man, that gym is awesome. It, it works you out. You don't have time. It is. It is. It is. It is. So, I'm not going to promote anything that I don't like and that I'm not using and I'm using it all the time. Come in and meet me on Saturdays. I'll be there at 8 in the morning to nine so if you want to shout out come and meet me it's all there man i'm here there i'm always in university and daily location so you can meet me so like i said go check them out so guys let's talk about the panthers right and i wanted to make this video and, and like i said in my last video i've been working 12 hour shifts it's been a long week unfortunately um my four co-workers had um the corona i'm okay by the way so i'm good but they had it, so I'm picking up the slack for them. So hopefully they'll be back in two weeks, and they hopefully they'll be doing good. So so hopefully they could come back. So it's really killing me the workload. So I I couldn't do a lot of the things I wanted to do. So here we are. So let's talk about. I've been asked this question, Assassin Man. How good are the Florida Panthers? I'm gonna break it off to you, cause. Our our photo pandas are being disrespected. Yes, I say it. Photo pandas are being disrespected. Cause we're not getting enough talk about this team. The media is not talking about it. Locally, yes, but I'm talking about nationally. We are not they ain't talking about this team at all. Here and there, but you always have the blue um the Rangers, the Islanders, um you know, just everybody else, the Penguins, everybody else, right? I'm going to say. And that's fine. And, and listen, no disrespect to those teams at all, you know, not no disrespect. But let me tell you something. For the Panthers should get respected. For the Panthers should be on the radar at every team because they're not the same for the Panthers, okay? They are not the same for the Panthers. I think they are getting disrespected. By the media, by everybody else, I don't think it's fair. I think this team has shown up. I think this team has played amazing. This team has not people in there. They have beaten the. They have beat, and I repeat this: the champs, the champs, the Tampa Bay Lightning. They have beat them, and I'm telling you, beat them, right? It was not like it was a lucky. No, they went in there physical and beat them. And I know Tampa Bay, like, oh, no, no, no. We went into your house and me beat you down like y'all stole something. And y'all could argue all day, and it's no disrespect. It's the truth. Now, if y'all beat us down, yes, y'all took one game too. That's fine. But nobody, nobody, and I'll say it again. This show said the Florida Panthers are going to shock the world, and they are. Nobody been talking about this team. Nobody has put respect on this team's name. They should be be respected because they already got 38 points nobody and i'm telling you go to the media go to everybody nobody had this team in the hunt but this 
this show, I was gonna say the S word, this show said it from the beginning to start. I don't bull crap y'all. I don't say what y'all wanna hear. I say it truthfully. I say it. I say it so truthfully to y'all. Because why? Because y'all deserve the truth. These these four the Panthers are not the same Panthers. These four the Panthers pray hard, pray aggressive, and knock people on the ass. Okay? On the I would try on the ass. They knock them down and they keep up. And they could go down three goals in the last period and they fight. And I love this. Joe. I mean the coaching staff, Q, all of them are just one. Bobby, Chris, um, Jonathan Hoover, my favorite player, Keith Yandel, Patrick, Ryan Chris. I mean, all of them are having a great season. Uh now we're getting Anthony back, okay? We're getting guys back now healthy, right? He's, and I tell you, it's gonna change when Anthony comes back, it's gonna be a change. And then the two player comes back, it's gonna be a change. Why? Right? He's speedy, he's in the first. It's gonna change the momentum. Why? Because now you got more speed out there. Now it's whole, whole, that's what it was missing. It's hard to, um, to, to contain. Now you got Tidbit. All these guys are playing well. Now, like I, I tell you again, again, again. These are not the same Panthers, guys. These Panthers are different. These Panthers hit harder. These Panthers go after your throat. These Panthers will hit. Now I tell you, I told you, the one game that they was gonna lose in the road trip. I told you that. I told you it's a back to back. Carolina should win this game because they rested, and and they did, and and you saw the Panthers didn't have that energy. I, and I didn't bullcrap y'all. I said I hope I'm wrong, but I think this is what's gonna happen. It's, and, and and listen, it happened. But again, they was in the game. It was just, you know, in the end, it's just one of those things. But fine, we could take a loss. We're not going to win every game. But for this team not to get recognized, for this team not to be talked about, this team is just under the radar. Maybe that's how they like it, and that's fine. I don't like it. As a fan, I don't like it because put respect on that name. Put th these, P these Panthers are playing because... The first thing you hear, oh, the Panthers had the, the first week or the first month, the Panthers have not played nobody. Let's see when they play somebody. Let's see if, when they play Dallas. Let's see when they play Tampa Bay. Let's see if they for real. Look at Dallas. They struggling. Tampa Bay, great team. And I'm not going to take anything about Tampa Bay because they are a great team. They are the champs. They are the champs. And they are a great team. And, 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 I'm a Panther fan, and but I'm not gonna say they not. They are a great team, and it's no disrespect to my my team, but they are. But my team beat the hell out of them. My team beat Dallas. My team beat the Hurricanes. My team has beaten not not above 500 teams. They have played up to the standard, right? They didn't win all the games with the Hurricanes. They didn't win all the games with the um Tampa Bay because you're not because. They are even, and they fight. So that's the difference. That's the difference. But they always aren't in the game, right? And just as that Hurricanes hiccup, that's it. But all the games, they always get points. And that's what you want, and, and that's the difference. Bobby is coming and playing a lot better. The defense are playing a lot better. Now, you know, you have some slump here and there, but they are. They, they better. Um... Gruner is uh, just one of those guys. He just, he just an enforcer, and he will pound the shit out of you. Let's let's get this out of the way. He will pound the crap out of you. Okay, they, he will pound you. He will elbow you. Whatever it takes. And 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 these Panthers will fight for each other. That's the difference. What I see this year about the Panthers. It's not the same Panthers. They're not a fit, finesse team. They're not just going to take the crap from other teams. When you push them, they didn't push back. No, you push them, they push 10 times harder. They come after you. They come after your throat. That's the difference about these Panthers. Now, I don't know why we did not get any respect, but we should got respect. Okay, we got to get respect. The media's got to start respecting us. Um, I just don't think they are. And I'm not saying locally, I'm saying nationally. You better put us in the spot. Because you got these crappy teams. You put it in the spot, but we not. No, no, no. You should put us in prime time. You should put us 
And there, why? Because we have earned it. We have, you see the Panthers growth, and they get better each and every game. And then the third period comes around, the switch goes off, and it's on, man. It's on. I don't know what Joe says, Coach Hugh says. I don't know what's going on, but it's switch it, and whatever our coaching, if that line not working, he breaks it up, and he puts other people in that line it's just amazing to watch um the game plans are 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 excellent you know sometimes goaltenders make plays but they always fight and they always try to get to that puck me only got shut shut out one time and 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 it's it just won those games man it, it just i love what i see i love the passion and 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 this fight for the pandas team brings it each and every time man i love this passion team this team will fight for each and every every inch of that ice. And that's what you want. Um, the face-off, I told you, they got to get better. And they've been getting better on the face-off. I told you, we got to start. The Panthers, for the Panthers to win, it's easy, right? Pretty simple. Pretty simple. Win face-off and hit and bring the energy. They do all that. They are going to do something special. I believe it. I'm a for the Panthers fan, yes. I'm not bullcrapping you. I'm telling you what I see, these I've seen, because I have not seen it for years, right? And I'm so proud that I made a YouTube channel by all the sports, because that's what y'all wanted. Nobody talks about the Florida Panthers, nobody. But this program will always talk about our team. Good, bad, or otherwise, we are going to talk. These Panthers fight for each and every, and, and Coach Q is bringing it each and every day with, with the game plan. And I told y'all, Cool. Everybody wants to get rid of Coach Q last year because, no, you can't get rid of He's a hell of a coach. You just have to bring his players in. The GM, great hire. You just got to bring. The, they had to work together, and they are, and they're bringing it together. So that's why. Right. And, and, and I'm tired of getting disrespect from the media, not to talk about the Panthers. And they have to talk about the Panthers. And keep on winning. Listen, easy remedy is Panthers get the 40th point tonight. We are good, baby. We are good. I can't wait to see them. The the forty points tonight. They win. I'm going. Unfortunately, I'm going to a birthday party, and I might do the video a little bit late. But y'all gonna catch it. So that's what I want to talk to you about. So I'm I'm so excited to say the Florida Panthers are here to stay. They are gonna beat up people, and we are gonna shock the world. Why? Cause I believe in this team and how they play every night. You cannot say that's a loss. You can't say, well, that might be a loss. No, every night you say, that's a win. This is a win. This is a win. This is a win. Because that's how we feel as fans. We think we're going to win them all. And then when we don't, we, we feel disappointed. But that's a good thing because you believe in your team. You want your team to succeed. That's the difference for years to come. So that's it. Guys, if I miss anything, hit me up. Tell me what you think. It's about the Panthers. In this video so hit me up tell me what y'all think guys but i want to say to all the fans thank you so much for supporting this show now amazing to me man and i can't say thank you enough but thank you thank you guys god bless see you later guys